Hello friend, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to discuss about how can handle all that error. You can handle it with the three block. One is the try, another is the catch, another is the final block. Okay, like first of all, I want to show you like here, first of all, that is a try. Okay, there is a try block and then there is a curly bracket. So into this a uh, try area, whatever the things that we see in our curly bracket area, if there have any error, it should be gated with the catch. Okay, so that is a catch. So there is a catch um, on the block. And into this clash block area here, you have to pass one of the parameter. Okay, here you have to pass that parameter. So this parameter means whatever the error, it should be get into the try. It should be get this error and into the catch area here, it should be pass it. Okay, here that will be executed. I hope friend it's very clear and also another block as a finally okay finally so that is a finally block so into this finally block that is actually work for every part like if there have any error then that will be executed and also if there have no error then also that will be executed so for the both time that will be executed i hope friend you get some of the idea so that is our try into the try area if there have any error it will be show this error in our catch and here and whatever the error you will be get it in here that will be pass it with this parameter okay and then finally will be work both of this area so better i want to do and to show you that things with the live example literally we'll do lot of work with the try and then catch okay friend like in your previous video i have already uh, added one of the function dev and here there it's getting some of the error right it's get some of the error in which position at index 9 right that means here so now i want to do and to take this part for education purpose i cut it and into the try area i simply paste it okay so now if you click as a save all and now if you go now you see it's not display any error but right now whatever the error is happening in here this error i have already taken with this parameter as e as i told you that is one of the parameter whatever the error it will be get it's passed this error in here so now i want to do and to display it okay here i want to display it with the console and then the console log and i want to do and to display our this e whatever the error it will be get that is a parameter now everything will be more clear to you into this with this parameter it will be now show this error if you know click as a save all now if you go click as a refresh yeah you can see that is a sign text error as a second parameter cannot be zero and every data that means every error is now display in here okay and after that there is a final d and into the final d area i want to do and to um, like if there have any error or also if there have no error it will be dis executed so i want to do and to execute it with the console log and i want to do and to pass one of the parameter um, string value as a it's work okay it's work perfectly or it's work because of all here they have some the error right i want to make it as a like as a it's work this type of one of the string value now if you click as a save all now go there click as a refresh yeah you can see it's now showing as a it's work that means every functionality one by one working right and also if you want to display the our error type like that is what what type of error is that if you want to display it you can also display it and also if you want to display that error message you can also display it because into the catch area it's actually get all that our error and pass it in our parameter so that is our parameter right so now i want to do here i want to hmm, display another one better into the this line i want to display it that is our one okay and also i want to want to console log with this console log here that is our event right so that is event and if you write down as event name then that will be display what type of error is that right now that is one of the syntax error if you know, click as a save all and now if you go click as a refresh now you can see it's now in our number 14 into the number 14 it's now display as a syntax error and also if you want to get that our error message you can also get it then that will be as a console and then the console log and here that is our element that is our um, error message and then i want to, want to declare another that is all that by default property as a message okay message i want to do and declare this message now or this error message should be display okay now let's check this out click as a save all now if you go click as a refresh now you can see there is a syntax error and also is display in our 15 into the 15 i display the message now it's display our message that means our error message as a second parameter cannot be zero now that is our message okay friend i hope you get some of the idea and also one of the most interactive things like there is a 
try catch and finally right he before i have already discussed about that things with you here if you get some of the error and after that error if you pass any new value right if you want to display any new work then that is not executed because of all if he gets any error that will be stopped in particular that area but when he use that as a try catch and then final okay after that like that is they have already one of the error after that if you want to print another execution like as a console uh the console log i want to do and to add another um, work like as a i pass one of the string value as a high rdn okay so right now that is appropriate right so now that should be work if you click as a save all now go there click as a refresh now you can see it's not displayed as a high rdn okay i hope you get some of the idea so if before if you use that and after that if you want to display some of the message then that is not executed right that is stopped in here but when you use that try catch final then you can see everything is great that means whatever the error it will be catch it automatically that will be executed in particular that position and rest of this will be relief okay everything is great so that is the try and catch remember this part that will be very important because we will use it lot of the time okay that is a try catch that is the best format we have to flow so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video